Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video of some Pokemon Scarlet and Violet VGC video. Alright, that was kind of weird. That that doesn't sound right for me, at least for my intro. Hey guys, what is up? Zorin here with another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet VGC video. That sounds better. Anyways guys, so today we're bringing you one of my own teams. I actually have been um, cooking this up for a while now. And I've been wanting to make a team with... Actually, there's a funny story behind this team. So I actually wanted to make a team with Cloth, but I I cannot t stress enough, I could not make that thing work, in, especially in this regulation. It was just too hard. Uh, I wish I kind of tried making Cloth work in a, in a much more tame re regulation, but I've, I've been improving in, on my team building. And back then, I, I it's just something that I would have never thought of while making this team. So yeah, so what happened is instead of cloth, I ended up making bear tick. But the reason it went into bear tick is because I actually had bear tick and cloth on the same team. Because I thought bear tick, hey, it's an ice type. It, it has swift swim. And once I learned how swift swim, like things like swift swim and like chlorophyll actually worked, I was like, yeah, the bear tick is really good. So then I ended up just going with bear tick and just scrapping the whole cloth idea, which is upset upsetting but it is what it is it's just it was just really hard to make work and i wouldn't be able to make it work i'm not that good i'm not that good so if you guys have any like curiosity of what the cloth set was going to be it was going to be a weakness policy set where you endure with the cloth and then kyro would surf and then cloth would be at one hp and you would have a drive in case there's priority to let cloth just go ran just you know run rampant with rock slides terror rock at plus three so and a plus one speed because it also gives you plus one speed thanks to anchor point but anyways guys that's just a little background story on this team uh let's just talk about the team real quick we do have bear tick with icicle crash but we also have encore on this bear tick since you're so fast with swift swim i figured encore is really good since it gets it i was thinking of charm too but there's so many things in this gen in, in this regulation that are either special attackers or just don't care about their um attack being dropped or they they, they have clear amulet so charm was out of the picture so I, I opted for encore and throw chop instead because throw chop lets you actually outspeed the shadow rider and then you could just throw chop it since they're not gonna know that you have throw chop they don't know what bear tech does right and if they do then oops but yeah we have never melt ice to boost up icicle crash here or terra ice to really really boost up that ice damage and it could it could do some damage you do you do need to ice terra if you see my on though if in, unless it terra's but it is what it is. Just, just something to note. Um, Icicle Crash cannot KO even, even um, with a. It cannot KO without the Terra Ice. Is what I'm trying to say. Now we have Landorus here with the uh, Terra Choice Scarf. A Terra Choice Scarf. We have the Choice Scarf and the Terra <laughs> Terra Ground to really, really hit hard. Choice Scarf has been seeing a lot of play on the Landorus now, and I kind of wanted to try it out myself. See how it does. We've got the Sandsir Storm, Earth Power, Psychic, and Sludge Bomb. Psychic is here for the Amoongus. Uh, in case you need to deal with Amoongus and like just whittle it down somehow. We do have Tornadus here obviously for the uh, Rain Dance. Great great partner for Kyogre. And then we've got Raichu here with the Fake Out Nuzzle Volt Switch and Alluring Voice. I actually didn't know it got Alluring Voice until like last minute because I actually had Terra Blast Fairy on this. And the whole idea is that Raichu is here for those Maridons obviously. Uh, like another way to deal with Maridon. Um, because if you Terra Fairy, they can't touch you, but you can touch them with Alluring Voice. So that's kind of the idea here. And Alluring Voice is nice because it also can uh, confuse them. So you have the Para Confuse um, thing going on if you really want to. And you have Amoongus here just in case you run into TR with those Ice Riders. You can kind of threaten them with support with their own Trick Room. But yeah, they, they usually have their own Amoongus, so you kind of have to be worried about that. But anyways guys, that's the team. Um, hope you guys enjoy it though. Let's see if we can get some wins. Uh, team ID and the rent and, and the rental will be in the oh, sorry the pokey paste and the team ID will be in the description below for you guys to use if you guys want to try out this team with the bear tick and um, as always just make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment if you guys want to help me out with the algorithm it, it does help out every view every view counts every view counts so with that said let's just get straight into it I've been yapping enough all right let's go okay 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 what do we got here we've got a Terrapagos team Terrapagos, Terrapagos. There is no white guard on their team. That's something to know. Hmm. 
How do I want to approach this? Does Tornadus come into play here? Probably. I really like Lando here too, though. Lando would be really nice. To... Is it like... I'm trying to figure out what they're going to try and go for here. I'll try... Yeah, I'll try these four. And see how it goes. I'll try these four. And see what I can do. I do have Throw Chop, but Throw Chop doesn't do enough on the uh on the Flutter main sl slot because of Fairy being resisted to Dark. I feel like they're gonna go cheat you. Okay, they're going to cheat you Flutter. Which is fine. I think it's fine here. It's probably speed booster, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. What I could do is I could Terra. If I want to though. This early on. Not really. I'll, put, I'll double protect. See what they go for. Also, I have a my 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 bear tick is jumbo, which is nice. So it's big. It's a big bear. Yeah. Okay. He does go for the fake out. He does go for the. Okay. I could have gone for the other other play that I wanted to go for. Okay. That's not too bad, actually. Because I can go for a water spout here and just go for like Encore onto the Iron Hands. Yeah, he's, gonna, he's still going to be faster than me, but I don't think he's faster than me enough to stop me from um, from this. Yep, Encore gets him on the fake out slot, so that's perfect. And we got a nice little water spot off on it. Ooh, that just destroys him. Okay. Okay. I'm telling you, Encore, Encore and Bear Tick is just it's just funny. We are, we are slower now, though. That's something to note. We are slower than this, this Terrapagos right now. But I think that's fine. I think I could like switch out. What does he? What could he have in the back? Maybe Chi Yu. It could be Grim Snarl. Which, if that's the case, I could go into Lando here. Hmm. I guess I could go for Water Spout anyways and just switch into Lando. I think that could work as well. Because he's stuck on that, he has to redraw, yeah. Perfectly fine with this. Or Urshifu, okay. Okay, it is Urshifu though. I could have brought the... um. The right you out. Maybe I should have brought right you out. Yeah, that's why I was thinking I was I could have gotten into right you. He got he went straight for Terra Star Storm too. Oh my god, dude, my luck. My RNG luck is insane. My RNG luck is absolutely insane. That's disgusting. Okay. Um. Nothing I can do is do like nuzzle here. But yeah, that that really. That really messes me up. 
I don't know if we can win this now. But I kind of needed my my dude. I kind of needed my dude there. Thankfully, the only thing I have, well, actually, I don't think I have anything that Tom does anything to, to me. But this is gonna do a little bit. Bro, what is with this guy and his crits? No, I, I, I lose. He's just critting. He's absolutely just getting really lucky. There's not there's not much else I can do about that. There's absolutely nothing I can do about getting crit on 34 times. <sighs> Team wasn't doing bad either. Cause we could have definitely won this. But uh, with it constantly critting me, I don't see how I win. I have to I have to pray that I get some hacks now. He needs to be getting hacked. Like there's no way he doesn't. Makes no sense to me if he doesn't. Really good damage too. Flinch and Para neither one hit. That's crazy to me. Yeah. That's that's just depressing. That I got double crit. Getting double crit there was really bad. Like really, really bad. Cause I can't even go for a um. I'll have origin pulse, obviously. I don't think I can win this though. He has Aqua Jet. It'd be absolutely insane if I could win this somehow. Those those crits were actually insane. It was on Raichu, so Raichu has a a sash, but even then, you know. The the crit that mattered was on Nando, because I could have had it way more down otherwise. Cause yeah, now I just don't win. There's just no way I can win. Oh wait, I could have won. Does he not have Aqua Jet? Don't tell me he doesn't have Aqua Jet. I could have probably won with Volt Switch. I just kind of like thought I lost, so I just kind of threw through everything, <laughs> through through a luring voice, just because I wanted to see it. He definitely has Aqua Jet. Oh, he doesn't. Does he not have Aqua Jet? I'm gonna laugh if he doesn't have Aqua Jet. He doesn't have Aqua Jet. Oh, deserved, deserved. That's so deserved. Oh my god, that was so deserved. Because uh, Aqua Jet would have cleaned up easily. Now that's deserved after getting all those crits. Deserved. Because because that would have put... um I could have put the, um, the dude on a much lower HP threshold. If Lando stayed alive. Unless Terra starts him just flat out chaos, but I don't think it does. Not at plus zero. Alright, GG. Alright, I'll take it. Okay, this is this is a regional team, isn't it? I, I remember seeing something about a uh, not a regional, a top cut team. I saw something about this, and I feel that's what this is. Okay, and that thing has vital spirit for sure. Um. I guess I could try this and see what happens. <laughs> I don't know what to do against this. I really don't know. This is why I was so tempted to put Cobra Cloak on the uh, Kyogre instead. Because if I were to do that, then you just get free water spouts and not worry about like fake outs. But I decided, you know what, we're going with Mystic Water. Yep, okay. That's what I thought would happen. I, I had a feeling this was going to happen, so I just went with it. This thing is fast too, isn't it? I'm going to go for Water Spout anyways. And go for a Sans Astormo. 
I want to see how much damage this Sanser does to a uh, Electabuzz with Terror Ground. I actually don't even think it KOs, but I'm gonna see. It's super risky to be doing this as well because it's right there, but yeah. Maybe Voltage is out too. We're max speed, but I know we don't outspeed Electabuzz. Electabuzz is actually really fast, right? This KO is out be huge. Oh, it, it KOs, okay. Oh, baby, we KO this. Nice. That's actually huge. That's so big. We are very weak to this Ice Rider, though. That's something that we need to know. Yeah, here's the fake out. Here comes the fake out turn. All right, Bear Tickets, you're, you're up. He probably just goes for Trick Room here, but you know. Oh, he has White Guard on this thing. Okay. Trick Room goes up then, yeah. Okay. Let's just go for this then. Okay, it's good. It's good that I didn't stay in with the uh, <laughs> the Lando though. But I wish I went for a Hydro Pump when I had the chance. Oh, he's gonna Terra. Does he have Terra Water? He would be Terra Water. Terra Grass. Oh my god, I, I should have went for Icicle Crash. Icicle Crash would have decimated this man. Here comes Glacial Lands. Doesn't do a lot though, so that's good. Okay. Three turns of Trick Room. I'm gonna protect. Double protect. Wanna see what this guy does? Knock off again. That probably would put me in range though. Doesn't have a fighting move though, but I don't have a Terra for that either. And I can't—I wouldn't even be able to Terra out of it. So I think we just have to take it. Uh, I don't think I can switch out either. A max defense, but I don't think I can switch out. So I'm gonna just gonna go for this. Let's see what happens. Yeah, I'm, I'm in range. Which is unfortunate. Oh, it's a crit. Bro, can I stop getting crit on? Maybe I live. Who knows? I'm never gonna know now. Oh my god. Okay. I can't switch out, that's for sure. I'm trying to think here. Hmm. Who's slower? Hurry up, because I know Arma is actually pretty slow. One turn of Trick Room left. I'm gonna go for Water Spell and I'm gonna go for uh, Pollen Puff here. Oh, he has Faint. Of course. 
course he does. He has faint. And I already terrored. Yeah, there goes Among Us too. Of course he has faint. <sighs> It all depends on what I have left. I mean, he takes off my scarf, that'll be great. Um. It really depends on what he has left. And if it's if it's the ditto, I lose. I lose if it's the ditto. If it's Ditto in the back, I lose 100%. I lose either way, because there's such a Luna in the back too. He did take off my, my, my Scarf though, which is nice. But it's not going to matter. My best my best chance there was to protect, but I, I didn't I didn't think about... Yeah, he does have it. Oh wait, it didn't... Okay. Well, let's hope. Let's cope. Yup. 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 My RNG in a nutshell, guys. My nu RNG in a nutshell. If, if that hit Ditto, we, we might have won. We might have won if, if that hit Ditto. It's absolutely a joke. We would have won if, it, if that hit Ditto, we would have won. We would have won. We needed it to hit Ditto. Out of the two, Ditto was the one we needed to hit. And we would have been fine. That's so depressing. Wait, wait. What? Oh, right, because I'm ground there. Mike. I'm like, what? Why can he hit me? It's because I'm only ground Terra, right? <sighs> I'm. I have really bad luck when it comes to Pokemon, man. So far, it's been three crits, and I miss a Sansier. If I didn't miss, I would have won. <sighs> oh well. Okay, can we have a non-RNG battle? Just f one no RNG battle where I get crit or I miss. Like, it's... it's Statistically, I have a higher chance of hitting things th and have a higher chance of not getting crit than I have of being crit and hit missing, okay? I'm tired of this. Stop it. It's not funny. Okay. I think that thing is Clover Cloak. I'm pretty sure it is. Um, what do I do here? Do I bring these two first? It really depends what I bring here. Because Bertica kind of works here too, but it's just if he brings a dumb thing and burns me, I'm going to be sad. I'll be really, really sad. And there's two two grass types. That's why I don't want to bring this. I'll just bring this, I guess. Let's see what happens. There, there's a lot of the meta, meta teams right now. The top cut teams right now. We can still win, though. We just need to not get crit on and miss Sansiers when it matters the most. Because Ditto wouldn't have won otherwise. We would have definitely won. Sadness. It is indeed sadness. Yeah, I, I had a feeling this was just coming out. What does he do? Squash me? Probably. I'll switch out. And go for like Nuzzle or something. We could put Light Screen up. Light Screen is probably possible. He's gonna tear her right off the bat, okay. That's 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 also why I swapped, swapped out Vertic, because I was like, he, he's probably gonna tear her out of his um, ice weakness. Which at least now I can hit him with sludge bombs, which is nice. Would be really nice. But yeah, that's gonna go up. He's Cobra Cloak too, so that's something I need to. Rem oh, wait, he's Cobra Cloak. I can't nuzzle him. Oh, we get the crit this time. That was a crit. Oh wait, that was multi-scale, right? 
We get the crit. Okay, you know what? Thank you for the crit, but it's not going to matter much here. I can't even nuzzle him. I forgot. I can't alert voice. I can't do anything like that. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's a little bit of a, a sad set there, huh? I'll go for another one of these and just fake this out. Okay, he does go for a spiky. I thought he might not go for it, but... Okay. Thought maybe he wouldn't go for it. I did just lose my Sash though, which is kind of bad. But it is what it is. Hmm, how, what do I do this turn though? Because Aeroblast just mercs me otherwise. I, I think I could go for a Protect here and just go for a Nuzzle onto this slot. I think that's my best play here. Because this at least gets me the Paralyze on that and I can hit him next turn. He does go for the Earth Power in that slot, okay. Oh well, we got the Nuzzle though, so that's fine. I'm cool with that. Power Whip, okay. He has the Power Whip. Hmm. I'm thinking here. What do I go for? Yeah, sure. I'll do. I'll do this. Might be fine. Unlock into Sludge Bomb. I know this thing is Cover Cloak. I know it is. I've seen the team, so I know it's Cover Cloak. Uh, I just need Water Spout to hit. Water Spout should just KO this thing. Hopefully. I'm, I'm really hoping it does. Could have gone for Sans here as well, but I thought Sludge Bomb would work better. Oh, it doesn't KO. Oh. Oh, it doesn't KO. Okay, we just lose our Kyogre. Ah, oh, okay. Well, that sucks. That really sucks. I mean, my only play here is to do this and just go for a Sludge Bomb on this slot. And hope a Paralyze happens. Yeah. But we're f I think I think my Lando's faster. Yeah, perfect. We're actually in perfect, perfect, perfect situation here. Because we can Encore this thing. Into protects. So, I think we're pretty much locked in now that Bear Tick coming. So that power up actually helped us. Because <laughs> it put Bear Tick out. Ready for that. And that's actually huge. I do lose my, my thing though, but that's fine. Because now I just go for like Icicle Crash into this and Sludge Bomb it. He might protect, but that's fine. But at this point, it's like it doesn't even matter. Yeah, he loses. Let's go. Let's go, Vertic. Vertic coming in clutch with that Encore at the end. Oh, that felt so good after all that RNG. I mean, Bertic came out clutch with those long cores for sure. I'm, I'm actually really happy with that. All right, let's get straight out into the outro. Okay, guys, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Now, yeah, the Vertec actually does come in clutch with the encores. I really, really do like the encores. Sadly, we didn't see any Shadow Riders to kind of just try to throw chop them. But I am, I'm happy with the results, even with those. R I mean, like we lost because of RNG. That was, that was, that was it. It was, it was RNG. Let's be real. The RNG was really, really bad because we lost Landorus to a Terra Star Storm that crit us. And I mean, what can we do about that, right? Not much. Not much there. But I, I'm pretty happy with how Beartech performed, honestly. 
Um, but yeah, um, Rage is very nice into Maridon teams. Lando, obviously another great uh, like damage carry for your team with Kyogre. Because this team really does rely on Kyogre to do its thing. Tornado is here with great speed control. We just didn't really need the speed control at all in this in, in these battles. And we had Amoongus here just in case. But I should have, I think against the Ice Ride, I definitely should have protected. That was my mistake. Because if I protected there, then I would have had a 2v2, right? Yeah, it's 2v... A 2v1. I would have had a 2v1 because then Ditto would have had to deal with a Amoongus and a Lando. And I could have probably just put it to sleep and then just try to deal with it. I could also Rage Powder there and try to deal with it there. But then he gets to hit... I, I guarantee you, if we ended up being Amoongus and Lando for the Ditto, I can guarantee you he transforms it to Lando and then hits Sansir Storm and hits both of them. I guarantee you he would have hit both because I have the, the bad RNG with that stuff. But anyways guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want to try out the Bertic team that I made, uh, the Drento and the Pokebase will be in the description below. Honestly, really, really happy to have gotten to use this Bertic. It's a jumbo Bertic, so I was really happy to use it. I tell you, I forgot to put names on it. So that's that's my only gripe, is that I forgot to put names on the team. But, oh well. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!